Hey, what's good everyone? Let's get this bread. In, in today's video, we're going to go over my watch list for today, heading into NVIDIA earnings. So to start off, looking at the economic data we're getting today, we get existing home sales 30 minutes in the market open. And two hours before close, we have the FOMC meeting minutes, which could cause a quick pop or a quick drop to the market. So be on the lookout for that. And going into it, looking at the earnings today, we have PDD, TJX, ADI. We, we also have Target and pre-market, Snowflake, post earnings. But the big one I am watching for and the main thing this video is going to be about is how I intend to play NVIDIA earnings because they're because let's be real. If, if you want any contracts that have potential, you know it is not going to be cheap but keep watching i have a way around it and real quick before we hop into the charts just wanted to allow you to take advantage of if if you haven't already and are interested when you sign up for mumu when you sign up and open an account with mumu using referral link down below in the description uh, it's normally seven free fractional shares worth 35 dollars whereas right now when you use my link you will get 10 free fractional shares valued at a total of 50 dollars when you sign up and deposit a hundred dollars that's probably going to be the easiest 50 percent return you make in your life so just wanted to share that and and going on taking a look at nvidia we have been in an uptrend since wednesday and if we look back to their last earnings nvidia has really been meeting resistance at this 950 960 area so as of right now we've kind of formed like a triple or quadruple top so we are either going to have a strong rejection of this level or we're going to blast through and make some new highs. And, and because of that, I am expecting a large move from earnings. The, the only question is, which way is it going? Is it going down or is it going up? The, the current range on NVIDIA is kind of insane. We got a range going from about 750 all, all the way up to about 975. That is a massive range. And, and if NVIDIA disappoints, I can see us making our way back down, coming to break 880, then 865, then 800, coming back to retest the 750 level. And if NVIDIA continues the momentum, I don't think there will be any hesitation to smash through that $1,000 level. I don't even think $1,100 is off the table. Nothing is off the table with NVIDIA. And, and another thing is there's been rumors of a stock split. If they say anything about a stock split on their earnings call, Yo, this thing is going to go parabolic. So because of that, expect a large move from NVIDIA. And the way I will actually be playing these earnings is actually going to be through the SPY. Uh, the last time NVIDIA had earnings here, let's take a look at the move real quick. So the last earnings was right here. They closed at 670 and then opened at 800. That right there resulted in a $10 move on the SPY after hours. Now looking at the SPY, the current range on the SPY is 523 to about 531.50. And it's not even in a $10 range right now. So what my plan is, if it opens anywhere in this range, I'm going to grab a put it open. That is going to be half of my play going into NVIDIA earnings. But my plan to trade NVIDIA is to buy a straddle. I'm going to buy a call and a put on the SPY. I'm going to buy them just right outside the money. I'm going to get probably about a week of time on them and I'm going to let the SPY do its thing. So ideally, if the SPY opens up here, I grab the put and then towards the end of the day, I'll see if I can get a better price on the call. But if I don't get a better price on the call, I'll probably just grab a call at the end of the day for whatever it's going for. The benefits to this strategy is with the expected movement from NVIDIA and the way that it'll affect the SPY, no matter which way it moves, I should be profitable with this strategy. So that's how I'm playing NVIDIA today. If, if you have any questions about this strategy, hey, be sure to pop in the Discord, ask any questions you may have. And one last reminder, if you haven't already, be sure to smash the like button. If you haven't already, be sure to take advantage of this deal right here. And, and last but certainly not least, Thank you so much for watching. Matthew Manuel signing off, and I want to change your life.